There are 13 people working in this office. So 13 times a year, Michael gets a cake and balloons and some sort of joke gift and makes a toast. And there are two types of toasts. One is a joke about how old you are. Look at those wrinkles. Blacks do crack, not crack the drug. And the other is something inappropriate or horrible <laughs> or both. What else? He only sings the high harmony to happy birthday. And he is a very big believer in surprise parties. Maybe even, arguably, possibly to a fault. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! <laughs> Happy birthday! <laughs> so I think, yeah, I think getting these out of the way might be productive. We can just have one big fun party and everybody's happy and nobody wastes their time. I don't like it. Wow, you're shaking things up a bit, huh? It's a pretty good idea, don't you think? Do you think it's a good idea? No, I think it's a great idea. Hmm. You know, try sending him another invoice. Okay. All right. Oh, did you see my memo, by the way? Let's be honest, as fun as birthdays are, we all could use a break from the costing cake, so let's celebrate birthday month in style today. This is really cool. Right? I, I was just thinking that... Oh, totally, we... totally. This way we get it all out of the way at once, and, and it could actually be fun. Right. Exactly. I knew I could count on you. Hey, Jim, can I have my own cake? What's that? I really prefer devil's food cake. Oh, sure. Yes. Okay. Yes. Wow, that was easy. Yeah, people like me, I guess. Jim. I hate devil's food. Well, I think Meredith was... Screw it, Meredith. I don't think it's fair to let someone else pick the cake on my birthday. Everybody's birthday. Today is actually my birthday, and I want to pick the cake. What do you want? I want pie. I want peach pie. You want birthday pie? I want a nice cobbler. Well, I'm going to talk to Angela, and we're going to see what we can do about a pie. I don't care who you talk to. Just make it happen. It'll be Angela. We'll tell her it's for Creed. She'll know what that means. Hey, Jim. Toby. Hey, I just got the word on the communal birthdays. Uh, Great idea. Oh, thanks, man. Yeah. Wow. Is there anything My I can... My birthday was two months ago. Oh, okay. There was no party. What? Well, it, it, there was, but Michael scheduled it for... 4.58 on a Friday, you know, I, people sang in the parking lot. Mm, I remember that. I don't know, I just thought maybe you could include me. Seriously? I just thought you could add me in, I don't, I don't know what the harm in that is. Toby's great. He's great, but sometimes he can be a little bit much. I don't see any harm in that. Well, it's a cake, Toby, so <laughs> come on. Okay, yeah, you know what, we're just gonna throw you in, because the more the merrier, right? No, no way. I am not a machine, Jim. You can't just change plans willy-nilly and expect these little magic party elves to do your bidding. We already have devil's food, peach cobbler, fudgy the whale, mushroom caps. I'm allergic to mushrooms. That's a bummer. Okay. Then we need to... Hey, everybody. Hi. How you doing? Could I have your attention, please? Because we have to talk about this birthday thing. Conference room? Yes. Conference room. Five minutes. Mm, no. No. We're going to solve it right here. We're going to actually talk about it out here. So who has problems with the birthday thing? One, two, three, everybody. Okay, so then we just shouldn't do it. What am I supposed to do with two cakes and a pie? Oh, I'll take them. Well, nobody's touching my cobbler. Hey, Michael. I mean, Jim. Yep. Phyllis called me Michael. And I will always and forever be haunted by that fact. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Creed. Happy birthday to you. Yeah! All right. Skip around the room. Skip around the room. We won't. Okay, all right. Yikes. Don't do that.